It is win or go home tonight at one end of the ice, or will they push for a game number seven? I'm James Sabalski. Peace rate for all. Let's find out. Opening face-off is just seconds away. The quest for Lord Stanley's Buck continues right here tonight, and we are underway. Makes a move, and the puck hops away from him. I know what he's trying to do, get in the space to shoot it, but now you've got to chase because you've turned it over. Now he takes it over the line. Tara Biden's got him along the boards. Great save by the goaltender on that one with the stick. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Aho's third eye zone ability is his incredible passing skills and his knack for completing difficult plays to set up his teammates. Marshawn's the full package when it comes to skating and shooting at the same time. His make it snappy zone ability makes his shot so hard to catch up to. Those are two players I'm going to watch closely to see if one of them could be a difference maker for their team tonight. Guys, back to you. Puck picked up by Svechnikov. Quick pass across to Pasternak. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Moves it to Slavin. Puck grabbed by Ajo. Fires it. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Read of the play was perfect, but it's his quickness that gets out tight to the puck. So the shooter can't elevate it anywhere. There's nowhere for the puck to go. Here's a short pass to Lindholm. Carolina's got a hold of the puck now. Scooped up along the wall by Marchand. Boston's got the puck here in the open ice. Poked away in the neutral zone by Natchez. Quick feed to Krizlik. The Bruins carry it along the wall. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. There he is from the slot. Oh, what a save in front. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Oh, and serves up a little too sweet with that save. Slides it to Burns. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Hall's got it in the offensive zone. Feeds the puck across to Natchez. And some textbook body contact there. And that's broken up. Sends it out in front, and that's stopped. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Carlo. And now it's grabbed by Coyle. Comes up with a stop. Moves it quickly over to Pacioretty. Carolina's got the puck against the half wall. And that goes off target. So easy to save from where I'm standing, James, but that puck's got to be on the net. Test the goalie. Make them have to make the save. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. All sorts of pressure here in the offensive end. They are really applying the squeeze. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Locks him against the board. That's a great hit. I love the way that he took the ice away and slammed him into the wall. Nice feed at center moves up ahead now. Here's a shot. Blocked in traffic. Slides it over with pace to Shea. Moves the puck across to Kasha. And that'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of action here tonight. We've got lots more still to come. Second period is just around the corner. Teams are back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. Who will be the first to light the lamp here as play gets underway in the second? One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? You see this a little bit with teams that are evenly matched. It's the early game feel-up where nobody really wants to take any chances, James. I mean, there hasn't been a lot going on so far. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. I like how he's able to follow the puck. Good save in close. Boston's in on the offensive attack now. Grabbed along the boards by Bergeron. Taken by Pasternak. Sends the pass in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. 
And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Quick pass to Smith. Close the puck. Cuts to the paint. Oh, he's going to get called on that slash. And let's see what the call is. The Bruins are getting penalized for slashing. comes out for the faceoff. What a great opportunity to get the first strike on the board. Scoreless game, you go on the power play, you want to attack this. You can change the way the game looks in the next two minutes. Another big faceoff looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Nietzsche has won the draw. They'll go to work offensively. Oh, he gets his glove on that and just enough to keep it out. I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. From the right side, takes the pass. And that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. There's the whistle. We got an offside. Fredericks recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. The Bruins win the draw here in the neutral zone. Puck scooped up by Aho. Here he is in close. He scores! Put the special in specialty. Well, the coaches have been talking about a few new wrinkles on the power play. They move the puck nicely, and the puck is in the back of the net on the power play. The Hurricanes are up by one here in the second. I like a lot of their game, but it's like they can't get these other guys to go away. It stays close, but at least they're playing from in front. Ajo's won the draw inside the neutral zone. The Hurricanes played along the boards. Rister turns it away. Wow, that's money for the goalie. They love those saves. Snaring a glove shot, dead center, slot, finished. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Hurricanes have taken a 1-0 lead. Stalls won the draw here in the offensive zone. Play whistle dead offside the call. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Carolina's won it. The Hurricanes played along the wing. Carolina's got the puck along the wall. Zaka's taking it from his own end. Moves it to Krizlik. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Stahl. Puck sent over to DeBrusque. The Bruins will play it in their own end. Carolina's got possession here in the neutral zone. Can't make the connection on the pass. Tries to get it over to Burns. And now he tries to get it across to Sutter. Pumps the puck away. He's got a step! And he easily stops that one. Thomas has been awesome tonight. I mean, it seems like the puck has been 10 feet in front of him the whole night. Yet it has not mattered. He is... Scores! And they go back to back to light the lamp. The momentum in the game changes fast. You get one, now you know you've got a leg up. You want to get another if you can. They get them quickly, and now they've really put them back on their heels. The Bruins win the faceoff. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Here's a short pass to Pacioretty. Carolina's got the puck against the boards. Scores! They are on fire! Yeah, and it's all different sources, too. Score a goal, make a change, get another one. Nothing seems to slow them down. 
The Hurricanes are putting on an impressive offensive display tonight here late in this second period. What's always funny to me about this is you talk to the coaches before the game and they tell you, oh, I'm not so sure about our team. And then they come out and play like this. Puck picked up by Pesci. Can't make it work. Hall's got it across the line. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Jarvis carries the puck in his own zone. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. Now a quick pass to Hall. They've got numbers here. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck in their own end. Carolina's got one last chance to make something happen before the end of the period. Hammers one at the net. Here's a blast. And there's the horn. Two down. One more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next. Teams are lined up and they are ready to get this third period underway. They've dropped the puck here in the third, and it's been a blowout thus far. Let's see if there's any sort of response. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. The Bruins will serve two for slashing. This 1-3-1 can be really effective. They've got a really good net front player that does a lot of the dirty work for them. Retrieves the loose puck, screens the goalie. It's not a glamour spot, but it's a key one. Boston's got a hold of the puck. The Bruins have it now. Feeds it on over to Frederick. Poked away by Pacioretty. And he takes the feed. And now he angles it across to Tara Vinen. Boston's got possession while undermanned. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Dished on over to Frederick. Takes a bump but hangs on. Poked away at center by Pacioretty. Burns gains the line and into the offensive zone. Marchand's time is almost done. Great pass from off the right side. They're able to wind the clock down a little bit here. They don't score on that power play. I don't know that it's... Per hey, it's Different level of excitement, James. You score in the regular season, that's one thing. You get another one in the playoff, and you are pumped. The Bruins have got one back here now in the third. They're really going to have to push. They're going to run out of time here in the last period. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Picked up along the boards by Bergeron. Up the neutral zone now. Takes the pass. Oh, if that's horseshoes, he'd be ringing it up. Yeah, but we're not playing that, James. What we need is a puck on the net, man. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. Thomas feels the need to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Well, this game is, is starting to run itself down towards the end. A, a mistake now would be a dangerous one. Nearing the midway mark of the period. The Bruins are still trailing by two. Puck grab by Grislyk. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Quick feed to Carlo. And he connects with the long bomb. And it's broken up by a nice defensive use of the stick. Nice feed. Moves it on over to Kotkaniemi. Boston's got the puck. Moves it quickly over to Smith. Boston's on the attack. And a stick in the lane to flex that one away. Boston's got control of it now here in the offensive end. And he shut the door on that last play. The Bruins gained possession along the wall. Made the stop on that play. Boston's gained possession. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. He's got control of it now behind the cage. 
to Gardner. Pass across to Pacioretty. The Hurricanes are across the line and into the offensive end. And there's the save. Picked up along the wall by Pacioretty. Cutting to the front of the net. Off the club and makes the save. They are really dialed in here tonight. And there's a hit with a little violence. as they clear the zone. It's a great way to protect the lead. Get it deep into the offensive zone and try and run around on the forecheck a little bit. Kill the clock when you can. Shot! And that's blocked in traffic. Sends a pass over. And that puck leaves the zone. Boston's looking to break out. Goaltender has made his way to the bench. The extra attacker's out. They need a goal here big time. The Hurricanes get a hold of it. Scores into the empty net. Well, he shouldn't miss that. I mean, there's <laughs> nobody standing there. Putting the cage, man. No pressure, right? In the final moments of this period, Carolina's been showing relentless pressure lately. Now up by three. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Directed over to Burns. Slides the puck across to Sutter. On the attack, they come down the right wing. Boston's got control of it now from their own end. Slides it diagonally to Martinick. And he slides it quickly to Burns. And called for the offside. We'll get a face off. Who had the edge in Carlin Bates' mind? She's standing by with the answer. Marshawn's gone to work, guys. And even though he hasn't been rewarded with a point, I've liked how he's played his game better. Poked away in the neutral zone by Aho. Carolina's got the puck along the wall. Hammers it! Oh, just a game of inches and Razor missed it. Yeah, the other side of the post, and he's got some damage there. The goalie's gonna have to be sharp. The chance goes away because it does not hit the net. Hammers a shot! And there's the final horn, putting a bow on this one here this evening. Here we go, three apiece. They will play a seventh and deciding game next. They gotta be ecstatic. I mean, here they are. They push the series right to the limit. You win in game six. You feel like you've got some momentum when you start game seven. Hope you had as much fun as we did here tonight, and we will see you the next time. At least we hope so. From all of us here at EA Sports, take care, everyone.